All right, everybody, welcome back to Cyberpunk. Today we're just going to be chasing the main mission still, see where that brings us. I don't remember what I did. I think I did some, like, leveling up and some inventory management at the end of the last recording that was, like, off recording, so some of that might be different. Apparently, I've also got, like, nine text messages, so maybe maybe I should, like, check out some of these text messages, though some of these are probably going to be not great. All right, here's the knock four times things, right? Okay, that that makes sense. I got blown up by that, like, what, two times at least? Another car to buy. I really admit to mistakes, but this time I will make an exception. I, under I underestimated your determination, yours and Takimura's. All I ask is that you keep my name entirely out of this affair. Of course, I will return the favor. And then we have a long message about a present for the Tiger Claws, which I will not read because I refuse to read it. And a car for sale. Wow, that car looks pretty cool. I don't know how much money it costs, but... I do, I do have a bit of money... But I'm probably just... I don't know what I'm using my money on. I was hoping I would find some, like, good weapons or good armor at some point. I haven't really found anything too crazy at the shops, but... We'll figure it out. What's up? You got a few more words about the porcelain cunt? Fuck! I'm about to pass out. Oh, no. Well, yeah, I actually am about to pass out. Uh, Johnny, you ain't dying yet. I got you. Oh, is Johnny gonna keep us alive? I thought Johnny was the one fucking us up the whole time. Maybe, maybe it's a little bit more out of Johnny's hands than I thought. He seems to be genuinely concerned. Oh, we got the pills in our hands. Uh, Johnny. That smells the sea breeze. Get up. Pacific's beautiful this time of day. <sighs> Almost flatlined by that attack. Almost. We in uh, Pacifica? What's this building? Old hotel, the Pistis Sophia, where her sole guests right now. Wanted to show you something. Come on. Why, why bring me here, of all places? Give me a minute. You'll see. All right, thanks, Johnny, for bringing me here. You took over. Couldn't just leave you there, could I? Nice to be behind the wheel again. Honestly, never felt better. Like in my life. I got you. No talking your way out of this one. You wanted to pop the pill. Gonna pretend you didn't say that. Alright, maybe I shouldn't... <laughs> maybe I shouldn't be rude to him. I'm still, like, having a very hard time here, but... Okay. I believe you. Thanks. Oh, can I not jump? Oh, I can't jump at all. Come on, my jump button doesn't work? This is bullshit. I have to hop in the window, though. Can manage that, I think. I can't jump over a box, but I can hop through a window, I guess. I guess there was no jumping involved in this. It was just like why I brought you here. pulling myself There's through. There's a hidey hole where I'm standing. Open it. Empty it. Oh shit, is this Johnny's gun? Do I get Johnny's gun? Probably not. It would be really cool to get Johnny's gun because it's like really good. Also, I'm stuck here. No, I'm good. I got it. <laughs> you, can't, you can't jump. I was able to like walk o over the table, but yeah, I'm not even going to mess around with that little area. I don't feel like getting stuck in a little corner. Reminds me of Fallout. I would get stuck in Fallout like all the time on mountains and shit that you just you would just get stuck in them sometimes. Kind of sucked a little bit. I mean, it's funny looking back at it, but when you're just like wandering the wasteland and all of a sudden you get stuck in the crags of a mountain, it's kind of annoying. But, you know, looking back on it 10 years later, it's kind of funny. Anyway, doubtless is Johnny's gun, even though that would be sweet. What the fuck is this? Dog tags? These yours. 
They were. Belong to you now. Oh, thanks, Johnny. Why are you giving me these? Imagine we're deployed together, fighting in a war, side by side. Would you take a bullet for me? Yeah, sure, why not? You know, whatever makes them happy. I would. Yeah. Tags belong to a man who sacrificed his life for mine in Mexico. Been thinking about our predicament. Want to be clear. I will do you no wrong. When the time comes, it'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get white. Tags are proof of my promise. I... I do the same for you. Yeah. Thanks. You seriously considering Hanako's offer? Got a better idea? Not yet, but I got a request. Well? Adam Smasher. Fucker who got the better of me. Whatever happens to me, I want him zero, gone, tossed into the wind as mulch. For some reason, Atom Smasher sounds like a porn name to me. It's supposed to be like Atom Smasher, but like, I just sounds like kind of porny to me. I don't know. I'm probably alone in Let's that, but <laughs> Johnny, come on! I'm talking about porn names. You know, you should understand this. Right. Understood. And I want Rogue to be there with you. All right. It's important to me, and it's just as important for her. So, I gotta tell Rogue... everything? Think I'd better do that. Handle it personally. You'll drop the pills from Misty, and I'll steer the ship for a bit. I'm not at all excited about this plan. Realize that, right? Just gonna have a quick chat with Rogue about Smasher. Then I'm out. I promise. It sounds really suspicious, but I'm a moron, so I'm just gonna, like, agree with him, I guess. Because, like, what else am I gonna do? I don't know, like, I guess I could try to fight him, but it seems like fighting him isn't really... So, you ready? It's not really the play. Like, it doesn't really seem to work, so I guess we'll just go along with his plan. You need to know exactly what you plan to do. I'll tell Rogue the truth. See if she's willing to help. Hey, Satan kicked me out of hell. Thought I'd swing by. All I gotta do is mention Smasher. Serve him up on a platter. Muse over the old days. Easy. Fine. I'll do this. For you. Appreciate it, thanks. Take me to the afterlife. Promise, you won't regret this. Feeling better. Should get going. Still feel a sharp something near your heart. Doubt that's ever going away. Uh, this all seems very suspicious. Just like everything has seemed very suspicious. He's like, oh, just stop taking the pills and, you know, it's just, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take you over shortly and talk to Rogue and then I'll, like, I'll give you a control back of your body and it's Don't like, yeah, okay. Mr. Sophia. That right? Mm-hmm. Good place to die. Just not today. It all, it all seems pretty suspicious. Hey, oh. I can jump now. Then I can jump over these boxes, or these are probably just like... Oh, no, you actually can jump over them. What do we got going on up here? Anything? Probably just garbage, just soggy car cardboard. <laughs> like, yep, just random garbage everywhere. Hey, we can go even higher over here. Think I could do some, like, parkour? Yeah, let's get over there. Bam, look at this. It's like crazy parkour action. Hell yeah, we're on the roof now. There's probably nothing up here, but... We're on the roof. We can probably get even higher. Look. Beautiful. It's great. Look at this. Nice big towers and shit everywhere. All right. So we got to go meet Hanako at Ember. I think. Wait, hold on. Let me let me check my journal here. God, where's the like. Oh, is this it? Yeah, this is the. So it's a side quest. It's not, it's not a main quest. So Johnny wants us to do this. Which is going to be a nice side quest. I thought it was going to be a main quest that opened up. Now I need to figure out how to parkour out of here. Since I parkoured up here. Nah, I can just walk downstairs. Alright, it's going to take 10 minutes to get down here. But you know what? 
Could you imagine walking up and down these stairs every day? I mean, I guess it's not that bad, but, like, holy shit, like, six floors of stairs? I don't know about that. For me personally, I don't know about that. Let's check the map. Let's fast travel. Let's get the hell out of here. A couple of salts going on down here. Well, it's not my business, so. I'm not the one getting assaulted, so I got I got some other stuff to do. Does, everyone's just, like, crying over here? Okay, well, I got... I, let's leave. Let's get the hell out of here. We got to go all the way over here, yep, to the old afterlife. We'll let Jonathan talk to Rogue. Hopefully Rogue will understand, and hopefully Johnny will give us our body back. Got a lot of hope going into this. I'm not very hopeful. I got more text. Why is my HUD messed up, by the way? My, like, HUD's kind of fucked up in the bottom left. Do you see that? I don't think that's how it's supposed to look, I'll right? Four f Pan Am text? Oh, come on. Why do I have... I can help. Pan Am says she can help. Hey, how are you? Everything all right? I hope you're getting somewhere with that biochip thing. Fuck it. I'll just come out and say it. I like you, V, and I miss you. I feel like an idiot writing that. But I know I'll press send anyway. Okay. Let's hit her with the miss you too with the kissy face. Bam. She's going to love the kissy face. I have an idea. Leave NC with me with us. Sol and I have been cooking up a plan for that exact reason, and we just might know how to help. This seems... I don't know. I don't know what to do here now. <laughs> See what she has to say. Listen, we'll do one last job together, get that head of yours sorted, then we leave this city behind and never look back. Besides, you don't seriously think I'll just up and leave you. Put that thought away for good, because I'm with you, V, and I will be with you through thick and thin. Interesting. Can I not, can I not reply? I guess I can't reply, maybe. I have another new job. Also, I can't, like... Okay, never mind. I'm crazy. I didn't want to call her. I've never used a telephone in my life, apparently. I'll right, catch you later. I butt dialed you. So, ready? Rogue should be here any minute. All right, will do. Uh, let me pull out my phone again, even though my HUD's kind of messed up. Let me open the text messages and not call. Car for sale, dude. That could. These cars are looking pretty cool. This is like a cool-looking station wagon, like cool in quotation marks. But some of these cars are looking like a good bit better. I haven't bought, like, a single car all game. Maybe I should think about buying one car, but... Okay. I'm ready. That was a loud swallow noise. <laughs> Very exaggerated. Hmm. Look a little different. Fuss with your hair, or... It's good to be back. I never knew you'd gone off somewhere. What's your poison? Blue glass tequila old fashioned. Tequila old fashioned. Top it up with beer. And sprinkle in some chili. Silverhand special. It's been a while since anyone ordered that. Well, we're going to be ordering it a lot more probably. Claire, don't don't we have like two more races to do? Give me another. You got it. All right. Well, yeah. I guess the Silverhand Special's back on the menu. If it ever lost, left the menu in the first place. If it did, it's back on it now. How many of these are we gonna drink? This is like the third one. Jesus. Dude, it's, he's just not gonna stop. a little much, you know? Know what I need now? Is it on the menu? Information. Cassius Ryder. He's still breathing. Tattoo guy? I haven't seen him in a good long while. 
gonna have to check up on him yourself. Works in Watson down on Pershing. All right, well, we just had like 10 shots of the Johnny Walker special, so let's go down plastered out of his out of our mind. I guess it's his mind, too. Oh, what the fuck? Well, I guess we just showed up here. Billy Goat. More my style. He's gonna love it. <laughs> Surely you will. Jeremiah Grayson. I heard he's an operator for Smasher. But you didn't hear that from me. Hey, who are you again? Yeah. Could say we had something in common. <laughs> Ruby Collins. Sloppy second for Grayson. After I banged her. Oh shit, this music. What the hell's going on here? This was a sudden change in music, I gotta say. Oh shit. Hey, what the hey, get out of the way. Drink slinger. Dude, what is happening here? Johnny's going crazy. Oh, she pushed us away? Come on. <laughs> like, what is going on? Oh, one of the glasses fell off the table, sorry. What is happening here? Left or right? What is this, the Matrix? Oh damn it! I didn't get to pick. He took the blue pill. Damn it! Like a Matrix you reference here. Yeah, hey, you Ruby. What? You've heard about me? Let's get out of here. Tell you what I heard. Then you'll show me if I'm right. Just got a little biz to take care of first. I just gotta throw up some blood here. Hold on. Get the fuck out of here. I got blood to throw up. Yeah, there we go. I'm looking kind of goofy, I gotta say. Yo! Get your fucking paws off Ruby. She ain't going anywhere with you. She's on that clock, got it? Fuck yeah, I fuck you. This. Oh, you got me back, god damn it. Oh, come on, one punch, I'm done? Be waiting outside. She's gonna come out, right? She's she's gotta come meet me out here. Me? Yeah, there we go. Let's go back to my place. Oh, okay. I guess we're just gonna steal this car. 